Hello again, it's Master McCann, and as you can probably tell by the setup, today's video is going to be on breaking, specifically the hammer fist technique. And I'm aiming this at the first cups, getting ready for first down. So we're going to go through practicing on the pads, the rebreakable boards, and then I've got a little block just for the end because I thought I'd give it a go. So I'm going to go through how to and how not to. We'll start off over here. First thing is hammer fist, though solid fist. You've really got to make a fist and squeeze it tight. This is the part you're going to be striking with. Okay? This is the bit. Now, when you're striking, and I'm going to start on the pads, but I'm going to demonstrate on a block first here. When you're striking the block, not here, the bottom of the fist on the edge here, you do not want your wrist on that block here. Okay? So it's going to come down, Striking here, don't go too far forward because if you get it wrong, it's going to be arm through the block, not hand through the block, and that'll hurt it. So, we'll start off over here. Hammer fist technique I'm going to be fully forwards. I'm right handed, so I'm going to left leg forward, right knee down. Good tight fist. I'm going to reach up as high as I can. Okay, so I'm going to bring it up. The left hand, I'm going to, for myself, I'm going to indicate where I'm going to go. And then as this comes down, this hand is going to pull back here. So that's how I'm going to strike with a loud shout when I do it. One of the mistakes we see is people putting their hand on the knee. If you put your hand on your knee like this to strike, you're limiting how much you can turn your upper body. So then you're just thumping it with one arm and not getting the full twist using your body weight and everything else that we want to do. Okay. So let's give this a proper go. So, fully forwards, indicate, reach up and breathe in. And then as I come down, I'm going to make that fist with a loud shout. Hey! And I'm not aiming here. I'm aiming through it. So I'm aiming to go through that first pad. I've got two pads here, and I'm aiming at the second one. If you aim at the top, you'll just bounce off. Okay, let's take that across to the rebreakable boards. Now, if at your centre, you can practice on the boards, that's fantastic. And this is what we should be doing, so we know what size block we will be breaking at the down test. Now, the rebreakables obviously join in the middle. That's where we want to be aiming. There's no point trying to hit it over here. That's just going to hurt and it's not going to look great. Again, square on, exactly the same technique. Hand up, bring it in, make a fist. Straight through the middle, aiming below the boards. Don't hit the floor. Okay? I say that in all seriousness. Stop before the floor. Last one, we've got a little block. Opposite leg forward, fist, I'm going to bring it down, loud sharp, <laughs> nice and easy. Okay, any questions on this breaking, feel free to message us, we'll go through some more, any questions that we've not covered today. Um, yeah, that's it. Hit it once, my best advice, shout loud, be confident, it's it like you mean it. Okay? I'm going to finish there with that one for you today. Uh, and if it proves a popular one, we'll put one up for back fist um, and maybe pseudo technique as well. We'll finish there today. See you all soon.